Hey guys, it's Wednesday morning. It is the first week of having class at home. Um, um, so all our classes are online for the rest of the semester, which kind of sucks. Um, but there's nothing that we can really do about it. Uh, so we're just gonna have to make the best of it. Honestly, I think some good can come out of it. Um, I'm just going to have to keep the right mindset about things because uh, one of the hardest things is going to be being away from all my friends at college. Um, like You can still connect with them over FaceTime um, and talk with them on the phone and stuff, but it's just not the same as interacting with people in person. Um, but anyway, so there's actually some things that I kind of want to get done while I'm home. Um, and one of those things is reading the Bible uh, and starting my day with scripture before going on my phone. Another struggle I will face is that in college, I never study in my room. Uh, I always either study in the library or like in the science center or s somewhere else. Um, so I've, I got this, I have a desk, so I have a decent setup. Um, you can see right here. So that's gonna be my setup. Um, Alright, uh, and so now, uh, one of our professors is holding virtual office hours uh, on Zoom, which I'm sure you've all heard about at this point. It's basically like this virtual FaceTime thing that you can talk with your professors. Um, but she has office hours every day from 9 to 10. And yeah, so I posted all my office hours, all my professor's office hours there. So I have that um, and can know when I can talk to them. Okay, uh, so I finished my online meeting with my advisor. Uh, we had a really good talk, kind of discuss how this semester is going to work for me um, and for next semester too, uh, because we're registering for classes pretty soon. Um, but yeah, so right now uh, I'm meeting online, obviously not in person, <laughs> uh, with one of my friends, uh, and we're going to review a whole bunch for the biochem midterm that we have next week. So I got a lot done with biochem. Um, I like to study with people at school, so it was kind of nice that we were able to study together like that uh, over FaceTime. Uh, but now I have a statistics assignment that I have to work on. Alright, uh, so I've been at it for a while now. I mostly finished my statistics assignment. Um, before that, like I said, did a bunch of studying for biochem. Um, but now, I'm going to take a little break uh, and work out. Um, since we don't have a gym. We don't have a gym at home, obviously. Um, just going to be some body weight stuff, so like push-ups and... So I finished my little home workout, uh, then I grabbed a snack, um, cause yeah, we're home, so we're hungry. Uh, but right now I have some statistics lectures, uh, and biochem lectures that- So we're gonna go ahead and do those. So I got done with all of my stats videos, uh, and our professor actually just sent us an email uh, just about like some updates for how the class is going to work. Um, it's one of the later ones she sent us. Um, but towards the end, she talked about like how we're not going to have like in-class, obviously. Um, and so she talked about email etiquette, and she said, don't send me angry emails. That will make me angry. If you send me a rude or angry email, 
I will just reply by sending you a picture of my dog. And that just kind of made my day. So, shout out to Dr. Inhurst for that. Um, but right now I'm going to take a break and go eat dinner. And that's honestly one of the best parts about being home is the home cooked food and not having to eat out of a college cafeteria. That what? what? That's healthy and it's tasteful. <laughs> Same! You're not putting this. Okay, so I finished up dinner and it was amazing. Um, but now I'm going on to join a meeting uh, for the salt company uh, at Penn State. Uh, it's like a. Christian outreach uh, program at the college, uh, and they're doing a Facebook Live meeting. Uh, so I'm gonna hop on that right now. Like, to really pull it all the way down, I just want to through the uh, clouds of fear, one of the wings has to be a dependency on scripture. But on the other hand, the... It's one thing that I've also started doing, uh, and you saw it a little bit there, uh, but I've been journaling a lot. Like, most of this book is just from this year. Uh, and we're barely into it, even though everything, uh, there's just a lot going on this year. Um, but that's something that's really helped me kind of grow as a person uh, and be thoughtful about kind of where I am and stuff. Um, so yeah, it's definitely something I recommend. It takes little to no effort. You know, they just write whatever you're thinking or, yeah. But right now, it's time for our organic chem lecture. It's seven minutes long uh which is awesome um but it's honestly my favorite class so and my professor made a youtube channel uh for the place to put our lectures so if you want to follow along subscribe it's called chem 262 organic chemistry see you there So, I'm done with schoolwork for the day. Uh, it's just about midnight. Um, like I said, things are starting to slowly become more routine. Uh, but something that I'm going to try tomorrow, uh, I wrote every so I write everything in my planner that I do for the day, right? But tomorrow, I'm going to try if you can see. Yeah, so I wrote times. for every time, like when I want to get something done. So I'm gonna try that tomorrow, um, and hopefully it'll work well. Honestly, quick shout out to all my professors, they're being really great about everything. Um, uh, and honestly, to everyone who's really adjusting to this time, um, especially college students, it's hard being pulled away from your school. Um, but yeah. We'll all get through it. We just have to dig deep, keep pushing. Um, thanks guys for watching this video. Uh, I hope it finds you well. Uh, I hope it finds you all safe and healthy. Um, and if you see or know a healthcare worker out there, take time to thank them. It'd mean a lot. See you guys.